All right, good morning. Welcome back to the Eagle's Nest. Miss Coltrane and I are so thankful to see you. Guys, it's October. It's October 4th, 2024. And we are here at Fairview believing this is going to be our best school year yet. Let's review our Fairview 5. Number one, actively listen to the speaker. Number two, keep your hands and feet to yourself. Number three, clean up your area. Number four, be kind to others with your words and actions. And number five, do your best daily, no matter what you're doing or where you are in the eagle's nest. Guys, it's Friday, so let's finish the week better than we have all week long. So that means I want you to give an extra effort to the Fairview Five today so that we are in here learning and growing together on a positive note. All right, and of course, we know and follow the Fairview Five, like I said, no matter where you are, because I need you to be classroom ready, hallway ready, recess ready, and you know it, specials ready. All right, guys? So remember, your specialists are always looking for that class to win the belt. So you want to make sure you're being specials ready. All right, guys. Today, we get to bring out the 95% club. Yes. Last year, it was 90% club. This year, it's the 95% club. So let's see who's in the club this week. Um, guys, this is all about attendance. We want to know what classes are showing 95% attendance or higher in the Eagle's Nest each week. So I'm getting ready to show you the classes that were 95% or higher in attendance. And then I'll tell you the class that had the highest attendance, all right? So here are my friends that are in the 95% club for the first time this school year. That is, oh, sorry. Ms. Reynolds class, Ms. Malatesta's class, Ms. Boone's class, Ms. Gilliam's class, Ms. McNeil's class, and Ms. Esser's class. Congratulations, friends. Thank you so much. And I want to see even more names on this screen next week, okay? I'm looking for 95% or higher. Last year was 90%. We're raising the bar this school year. So 95% or higher attendance. Here are our grade level um, percentages this school for last week or this past week. Kinder, 90%. First grade, 89%. Second grade, 92%. Third grade, 95%. Fourth grade, 96%. And fifth grade, 94%. As you can see, third and fourth grade were at 95% or higher this week. And I'm so proud of you all. I'm proud of all of you for coming to school because you have to do your part by being here. Let's encourage our friends to come every day so you can get that score, your percentage up and get in the 90% club. All right, let's move on to our championship belts. Are y'all ready? I'm ready. Okay, the cafeteria belt goes to Miss Sanders kindergarten class. Woo -woo! The specials belt goes to Miss Price's class. Way to go, friends. The bus belt goes to 1368. Hallway belt. This is going upstairs to fourth grade. Mr. Eisenberg, let's go. Congratulations, fourth grade, Mr. Eisenberg's class. And the attendance belt. This class had 99% attendance. 99%. And that is none other than Miss McNeil's third grade class. All right, that is awesome, 99%. That is awesome, my friends. So teachers, please send someone down to get your belt so that we can celebrate them, okay? And also, something else to celebrate, our Scholars of the Week, when I call your name, please come down to the office and get ready to run the hallways. My Kindergarten Scholar of the Week, Skylar Brown, McLean Brown. My Kindergarten Scholar of the Week. Let's go, girlfriend. First grade, 
Women's Scholar of the Week. Nagina, come on down. My second grade Scholar of the Week, Leah Rose. Congratulations, Leah Rose. Third grade Scholar of the Week, Naziria. Naziria Bass. Fourth grade Scholar of the Week, Julius Curry. Come on, Mr. Mr. Curry. We can't wait to see you. And our fifth grade Scholar of the Week is Janae Lafudu. Come on down, Janae. And then another, our pre-K. Sorry, pre-K. I didn't start with you. Dasha, come on down. We'll see you down in the front office. And we cannot wait to get in the hallways and celebrate our scholars of the week, my friends. All right, before we get started, we're going to get in the hallways in just one second. Put away your cell phone and your book bag so we can lessen all distractions. We want to be focused. We want to be locked in because we're giving extra effort to the Fairview Five. So please put those cell phones away until you leave today, okay? Voice level zero when traveling through the hallways. We cannot distract others. We have to show respect by following the Fairview Five in the hallways and being on a voice level of zero. Bathroom breaks are only as a whole class unless it's an emergency. Be mindful of your voice level in the cafeteria, voice level zero while you're eating, voice level one once it is changed, the cone is changed to a yellow cone. Each class should play in their recess zone. Remember, teachers, you got new recess zones um, on October 1st. They were in the weekly memo last week, and um, I'll put them in there again this week so that you have them. But we have new recess zones for this month of October. And teachers, take your attendance as soon as we finish with announcements and scholars of the week. All right, my friends, let's keep it moving. We are believing. We are believing. This is going to be our best day yet, friends. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being on time. And I'm going to go ahead and just thank you for following the Fairview Five because I know you can do that. That is the way you're going to show that you believe in Fairview and you believe in yourself. All right, friends. Okay, it's time to roll out. But before we do, at Fairview, we believe good is good. Great is great, my friends. But elite is elite. And so let's go and be just that. And I'll see you all in just a second. <laughs> 